but it's the God on the inside. And now that you have become naked and empty, one night with the king, you ain't gonna get pregnant if you don't spend one night with the king. God making an impartation right now your intercession he didn't bring you to this conference just for it to be another conference he brought you here that you would deliver the miracle that you've been waiting on for years something's getting ready to be birthed I wish I had that see I wish I had some some deep folk in here that believe that God is able to bring you to uh-huh. Uh -huh. Let me tell you something. The reason why you've been in the valley, because that's where you got your anointing. That's where you got your birthing. Uh, you, you don't get anointed by being on the mountaintop. You get anointed in the valley. Signs and wonders come as proof that you've been in the valley. Birthing comes as proof that you've been in prayer. Let me tell you something. When you go in prayer, and prayer always births something, it births ministry. It births a Christian popularity. It births even doors opening. It births businesses. Nothing is birthed until it's in the face of God. That's why it's not good to let everybody pray for you. You got to learn how to get in the presence of God for yourself. That God can make an impartation and a visitation in you. Touch your neighbor by the head and say, neighbor. I've been in the presence of God and I'm waiting for my miracle in 72 hours. Your signature on the dotted line. Is there anybody in here? And I pronounce over your life that you are a wealthy woman of God and that you will never be broke another day. I wish I had a few witnesses in here. I wish I had a few people that would believe that God is still in the miracle business. I wish I had a few people that know that God is still able. I wish I had somebody that could say God is a miracle worker. Somebody get ready to give you upfront money to start that CD. 
And I see you with your own reality show. Hey, shabba, ba, 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 ba. And your name shall be known in eight continents. Just as Michael Jackson's name was known, God said, Your name is getting ready to be known in the spiritual arena. When they say, Who should we call? People will say, Call him. And there's a fire that burnt all oh, Shabbat. And the Lord said, I shall give you a visitation in the next three days. And I shall give you instructions. And those that said you would never make it would have to come and sit under your tutelage. Hey, Shabbat. Because the Lord has his lips to your ears. And your worship will cause people to get out of wheelchairs. Will cause people to get out of deathbeds. Your worship. I'm not at the most side. When you sign your name on those papers, you can sign the greatest contract. Everybody that was obedient. I guarantee you in the next six months, you get ready to sign a legal document. Oh, Shamasa. Hey, Gananamasa. And God should give you favor. Hey, Shamasa. And some of you will have jobs that you know you're not qualified for. Some of you will sign checks that you know you don't deserve. Mortgages that you know you can't pay for, but you said, I believe God. School papers, grant money. I'm telling you, Pastor Anita, an, an apostle, there's an influx. You moved in this building and you said, I know that we don't have the amount of people that will cover this building. But we're stepping out in faith. And God said, because you did, you get ready to buy this whole strip mall. And it won't be a problem. There's a cash flow that's getting ready to come. Because somebody get ready to give y'all some upfront money for your ministry. Jesus. I decree this whole mouth belongs to abundant and true ministry. Okay. Okay. 
broadcast after television broadcast. So you just have to get your own. <laughs> Tyler Perry is getting ready to come to this church. We're going to do some filming here. I believe it's possible. Because there's a transfer from heaven here. Tyler Perry will come here and say, I'm going to film a movie here. Because I want to let the people, I want to depict the black church. Major connection. Divine connection. If I be a woman of God. If I be a woman of God, I prophesy over this house. Signs, wonders, and miracles. I prophesy. I never let those sign. That your children will be saved. That your bodies will be healed. That you will rise up and be in God's glory of me. Somebody say yes! in this room right now. If you're not spiritual enough to receive it, 
Don't you stop your neighbor's miracle. Yes. If you're not serious enough or deep enough or supernaturally enough to believe what's going on in this room, and if you need that seed before you can believe, then we're not talking to you. We're talking to people that's been in the face of God. We're talking to people that's been in the presence of God. We're talking to people that say, Lord, I don't want your hand. I just want your face. The Numa is in this room right now. The Ark of the Covenant is in this room right now. There's some things happening for you that never happened for anybody else. God is getting ready to go back in your life and say, what have we done for him? What have we done for her for what she has done? For the kingdom. For the, because she has labored. But does he stay with the program? Because he didn't give up. He didn't denounce me. What have we done? What has heaven done for this person? Bring out the signet ring. And let's reward them now. Let them move. There's a substance glory. A substance glory is coming over.
Receive it. Just lift your hands. Say, Lord, I receive. I receive, Lord. Whatever you have for me, I receive. Do it for me, Lord. And then the most time, you didn't bring me this far for me to fail. Here I am, Lord. I empty myself. I bow before you. I just saw three angels run around this room. I just saw three angels run around this room. For his glory. For his glory. For your glory, Lord. Jesus. Oh, shame I see, Karabasa. Jesus. I see so much profoundness in this room and where God is getting ready to take you. Your eyes have not, please don't take this as hoopla or fanfare or gimmick. The devil will try to make you have a heart attack. Something is going on with your heart. Am I telling the truth? But God said it stops right here. On the anointing. Can you receive that? You are healed by the stripes of Jesus. You said I might as well give up. But God said I got need of you. Loose the coat in the ass. I have need of thee. There's a strange anointing. God get ready to bless us in this place. And we know spiritually we've already been blessed. But I'm talking about naturally. The manifestation. I speak it in this house. And the manifestation molds me. It's getting ready to come. And I'm going to tell you this, Pastor. This is the last horizon plane that you'll see any of the seats in your horizon plane. I come from Africa. I come from India. I come from South America. Hawaii. said, I see your work. And I'm getting ready to bless you now. Come on, clap your hands for Jesus. Come on, stand on your feet and give him a round of applause. Come on, if you believe him tonight, give him a round of applause. Come on, no, that's pretty bad. Come on. Come on, I need some intercessors. I need some people that's going to make this happen. Keep clapping. Keep clapping. Now why are you clapping over the field? I'm going to let the fruit of your lips. Say, God, I believe you. Come on, if you would just go around and bring people to see your miracle into your house. Come on, don't be lazy. Don't be lazy. Speak it. 